our current topic is what is checkpoint in root donor in order to verify that the server after getting the request returns expected response we use verification checkpoints in root donor these verification checkpoints matches the content from the response coming from the server and verify that the response coming from the server is as per expectation in order to verify all the business flow recorded in the script is working as per expectation we use verification checkpoints there are two types of checkpoints in root runner one is image checkpoint and second is text checkpoint now let us consider a scenario to understand it better i have to log into a web application and verify that welcome page is appearing or not we use either text checkpoint or image checkpoint after applying checkpoint when we replace the script if we find the checkpoint is in pass state we can conclude that expected text or image is present on the welcome page in the scenario the content coming from the response matches with the expected content given in the checkpoint one more thing to be noted here is that we can use we can add checkpoint during and after recording of the script during both the time before the recording the script means while recording the script also we can add checkpoint and after recording after script is generated we can insert checkpoint now for enabling checkpoint in node runner we need to make some changes in runtime settings of the script we need to go to runtime settings and in the preference section we have to enable image and text checkpoint which will be shown in the live session let us see that in live session for enabling it we have to go to runtime settings runtime settings and in this preference section under internal protocol we have to check it enable image and text checkpoint and then we need to save the script so this will enable our checkpoints there are two types of checkpoint one is image checkpoint and another is text checkpoint we have enabled image and text checkpoints now we will be able to apply image and text checkpoint after that we will need to set the script now we will go to view and then select the script generator when we will be double click on the script on the script we want to put image checkpoint now we will image or text checkpoint now we will go to view and click on the script toolbox go to view and go to script toolbox first of all i will go to Step navigator and in the step navigator we can see the images. Here suppose here we can see that text check text are appearing. So I am double clicking on it. And here we need to insert that text checkpoint. So let us see the page itself. Suppose I have to see whether this welcome welcome is appearing or not. So we will be adding this welcome in the script to see whether this text is coming or not. We have to add uh, text checkpoint. Let us see how we will be adding text checkpoint. now we will go to view and uh, script toolbox and here we are using the function web underscore range underscore find here in the tool itself to see web underscore range underscore 
find. Now I will drop this function in the script itself. Now you can see clearly search for the specific text. Our text is this one. This is the text for web tool application. Welcome. I am copying it from here. And uh, let me search for the specified text. I am putting it here. And I am clicking on OK button. And now I am saving the script. And I am replaying the script to see whether I am able to replace the script successfully or not and our checkpoint is passed or not. Let us see. This is script has been generated and now I am replaying the script. Just a minute, if it is not working now. Okay, so it is running on the local host, so we can see that the script has passed and let us see it in output log. Let us search for welcome, but the script is. You can see here the string WebRace find was successful, which means that after login, that welcome text was there on the application. That's why it is saying here the string WebRace find was successful. Now, if I am making some changes. I am giving wrong content here. Now I am writing welcome mm -hmm. mm -hmm. This is wrong text. It is not present on the web uh, web page. So now the script should fail. So you can see here the script has failed. That means this is verification checkpoint is working correctly. So this is all about text checkpoint. Now we will be seeing image checkpoint. So let us go to the page. Now let us go here and see if it is image or what. Nice and we will go to view description box. And here I will use mail underscore mail underscore check. Now I will be driving, dragging this up. Uh, checkpoint function in the script here you can see 
alt attribute and src attribute which is asking for so you can see here the alt attribute and src attribute both in the play the script now the script should pass So you can see that we placed it as it passed and our script has passed. So we can see that our both text and image checkpoint has passed successfully. So now we have understood that we use checkpoint to verify and validate server response whether the text or image is is coming in the server response as per expectation or not thank you